Christelle, I'm French and I want to share with you my trip to Sevilla, a city in Andalusia in the south of Spain. So this video is about day 7, which is Friday, the 11th of November 2022. So here's the program for this day. It's going to be a rather relaxed day. First, I want to see the Casa de la Ciencia, which is the Museum of Science. Then I want to have lunch at the Huerta del Rey and see the Jardines de la Bujaira. And then, because I have seen everything I wanted to see in Sevilla, I'm just going to relax and take photos in the Parque de Maria Luisa because I really enjoy this park. And last but not least, I will go out in the evening in order to find some souvenirs and to just have dinner outside. First, let's go to the Casa de la Ciencia. Good morning. And so it's near the Parque de Maria Luisa. So I need to go down the city center, the cathedral, and so on. I'm starting to know the city center completely by heart. Cathedral. Again. So that's time for mass before the visit. Christmas tree. So, so we have the Torre del Oro there, and I'm going to the Casa de la Ciencia, por aquí, Casa de la Ciencia, beautiful building, and look at the balconies. So now I'm going to see the Jardines de la Bujaria and Huerta de Rey, which is just nearby. <laughs> okay, so that wasn't really the most interesting museum. It was really small, not a lot of things to see. Just like a lot of science museums, it's basically like aimed at kids. Like a lot of it is aimed at kids. And which is a bit disappointing because I mean as adults you can also get an interest in science. So yeah, not massively interesting. Um, for example the planetarium, it's only for school groups. Now I'm going to have lunch at the Huerta del Rey and see the Jardines de la Bujaira. So I've got Huerta del Rey and Jardines de la Bujaira. And now I'm going to have lunch here in Huerta del Rey. Palitos de Mar. It's crab. Alright, so I finished uh, lunch. This garden is rather pleasant, but there's nothing to see really, so I'm going to go out of it and go just on the other side of the street to the Jardines de la Bujaira. 
all right so that's the whole park so it's not really big very interesting building there so is this uh, Moresque building Okay, so I think I've seen basically everything I wanted to see in Sevilla and I'm leaving tomorrow so this afternoon and tomorrow morning I'm going to have time to do whatever I want to see things I've, I've enjoyed so right now I'm going to go back to the Parque de Maria Luisa which I really liked and the Jardines de las Delicias Deliciosas that uh, because I went through those gardens but I didn't really visit them so yeah I'm going to do that and now that I have seen everything I wanted to see I'm just going to relax and take some photos at the Parque de Maria Luisa so we have Plaza de España well the side of it and I've got horses and I really need to find some toilets I'm glad I took some photos the other day because it seems there are some constructions in front of a Plaza de España one the other day because that was great so today it's mojito and it's really good all right so right now it's 4 p.m and the plan for tonight is i would like to go to the hotel to rest a little bit then go out again for dinner but have some time before dinner to do some shopping for like souvenirs and stuff for the family so probably i should be getting to the hotel around five six 
and go out again around 7, 7.30. Plaza de America. Jardines de las Delicias. So that's basically a part of the Parque de Maria Luisa. Um, here. That's the Plaza de España. That's really big. So I've done the Jardin de las Delicias and now it's 4.40 and I'm walking back to the hotel to rest a little bit in order to go out again tonight. I see a lot of like Loteria and stuff like this. Apparently Spanish people are really into the Lotto or like betting and stuff. Alright, now I'm going out for some shopping and for dinner. Alright, so it is. So it's about 7. I nearly fell asleep, but I didn't. And now I'm going out again to do some shopping and to have dinner. And the shop that I'm looking for is this one company that has been working for 70 years. Alright, so I found two beautiful ties that I like. And now I'm looking for some postcards. Okay. So I have my postcard. It's nearly 8 p.m. and the restaurant that I was interested in only opens at 8.30, 8.40. So yeah, I'm just going to walk around a little bit. But look, we can see the Hiraelda. I'm going to go see the Santon. The Santon. What the hell is happening? I mean, that's probably more Nazareth style. I think the difference between here and France is that in one place you can find many different styles and it doesn't look like handmade whereas in the south of France some workshops are still doing it themselves there are balloons so much detail this is really cool I think that's the best shop in this, in this market really like look at those so I actually 
actually bought some stuff for the family. I'm just doing it Spanish style. Eggplant with goat cheese. Hi, tattoo with egg. That's the end of day 7. Thank you for watching this video. I really hope that you enjoyed it. And feel free to like, share and subscribe so that you can see all the upcoming videos. And I will see you soon for more adventures in day 8 of my trip to Sevilla, which is going to be the last day of the trip.